the Reserve Bank governor has been in a hurry to lift interest rates. Since May, Philip Lowe has presided over five back-to-back -back rate hikes to try to combat rising prices. High inflation is a scourge. It damages our standard of living. It creates some additional uncertainty for households and for businesses. But he's now hinting we could be close to the peak. We recognise the case for a slower pace of increase in interest rates becomes stronger as the level of the cash rate rises. He's concerned about China's slowing economy, the war in Ukraine and potential recessions in Europe and America. A sharp slowing would make the job of delivering a soft landing in Australia very difficult. Some economists say Australia might be able to avoid a recession. But the higher that cash rate goes, the greater the risk of a hard landing. Financial markets are still betting on much higher rates, as much as 4% by the middle of next year. We don't think the Reserve Bank will get there. We think that the amount of tightening already in the system is enough to slow the economy sufficiently to bring inflation down over time. The RBA Governor Philip Lowe has faced growing calls to resign this week because of statements made by the Reserve Bank late last year that interest rates are unlikely to rise until 2024. But today, Dr Lowe said that was never a promise. So now it was interpreted that way, uh, but we did not say that. It was a conditional statement. I can assure you I have no plans to resign. His term finishes up in September next year. David Chow, ABC News.